Home and Garden Show features more than 200 home improvement, gardening, and landscape design experts all under one roof. The show is happening this weekend at Richmond Raceway. And that's where we find Antoinette Essa, who is joining us live this morning from apparently your backyard now. Antoinette, good morning. <laughs> It looks like my dream background backyard with a hot tub and the water is perfect. I could have been in that water next time. But look, guess look at who we got. We got Mike Pyle from HGTV Inside Out and this is Mike's specialty. He yeah. does all of this in a blink of an eye, right? I do. <laughs> kind of sort I do. Of right? Not non Richmond, <laughs> but I, I do. I do. You've been in this business for 20 years. This yeah. is sort of like the epicenter for families and homeowners to come and get ideas, right? Yeah. No, I just walked through right now and there's some great great things to check out and they got a little bit of everything. So is is design kind of like fashion? What's old is new again? To an extent, we don't want to, you know, the design is, industry is always changing yeah. within landscape, interior homes as well, so we're always trying to adjust. But you always want to pick kind of those staples that are going to be timeless. Mm -hmm. um, you don't want to redo your yard every five no, years. No. So you want to you have some staples in there, and then you can just kind of tweak little things as the years go on. What are some of the staples? I mean, you need a, if we're talking, you know, at this show, we're talking the curb Ashland appeal. Farm. This is kind of, yeah, yeah, they've done a great job here. So this show, we're talking curb appeal. So you need a specimen tree in the front of your home, whether you have a garage door that stands out or a painted front door, seasonal color, you mm -hmm. could add pottery out there. You could be changing out, you know, as the year goes on. There's lots of little details that you can keep current with. And then your backyard, any big tip that people need to. I mean, the backyard, I'm all about getting people outside and extending the square footage of your home, right? Yeah. So get a fire pit back there, get a barbecue an outdoor kitchen area, create moments that you guys want to gather around, yeah, yeah. so you're going to use that space. And you know, a lot of people are downsizing, so people have small spaces now. Any tips for people with small spaces? Yeah, the, the biggest thing that I like to incorporate within my designs is built-in seating. So if you build in a bench, you're actually saving room because you're not having to pull a chair in and out, and it's mm -hmm. a little trick where you're going to gain 24 to 36 inches within that space if you're limited. Awesome. When yeah. uh, are you going to be here today? What time? Today, 11 o'clock and 3 o'clock. And come with lists and pictures. Yeah, come with, come with questions. Let's have some fun. You know, I'm I'm usually talking for 30 minutes, but the more questions, the better. We can yeah. go up to an hour if we want. I wish we could go up to an hour, but Mike, thank you so much. Yeah, thank Opens you. Opens at 10 today at Richmond Raceway and 10 tomorrow, right? Uh, t yeah, 10 tomorrow. You're opening too. All right, Greg, back to you. Come with your list and your questions. As Mike said, he loves to answer questions.